maybe you just want to learn more about how Docker works on the command line. You want to be able to utilize it. You know what it is, but you don't know how to use it. This course is for you. So in this nugget, we're going to create a simple Dockerized app and actually run it in the real Docker environment. I like to think of images and containers as like the image pasture in the container arena. And what I mean by this is here in the pasture, we have things like images that will host Java applications or images that will host PHP applications. And these images are kind of like a pure version of the environment that's required to run those applications. Okay, so it downloads all that, it extracts it, and now we have the CentOS image locally on our computer. It uses that image to create a container and inside that container it runs the application we told it to. Now our application is just this simple script. So right now we have a container that is counting. One, two, three. <laughs> We're going to dig into Docker. We're going to use it, set up applications, create our own applications, Dockerize those applications, learn all those fun buzzwords so that you can sound really nerdy at the water cooler. And at the end, you're going to understand what Docker is, know why Docker is important and why you should be utilizing it in your environment.